a plumb one? Well, it's time to unsheath my weapon of choice. Guys, welcome back to the channel. It has been too long since I've been out flipping a fly. We are here on the Henry's Fork with my good buddy Ethan. Ethan's boats. We're gonna go try to catch some of these wily trout they call the Henry's Fork home. I think today we could get into a lot of different stuff. You know, nymph, nymphing is always a go-to here, rubber legs. So the salmon flies, I'm here in, in the next week to 10 days are gonna start popping. We're looking to throw maybe some rubber legs today with maybe a, like a pheasant tail as a dropper bug and then maybe get in some dry fly later on in the afternoon it's a good day for fish and a little overcast it's warm uh should be good but the reports we're hearing for the lower section right that we're going to float is all thumbs up so hopefully it's a phenomenal day it'll be a phenomenal day nonetheless but i keep saying it you add a 30 inch brown to that be excellent day There's a fish right there. See it is. Eat man hooked up. Hooked up, baby. Boski. Break off the stink. Yeah. Oh, good net job. Flop, flop, flops, flops everywhere. <laughs> nice, buddy. Yeah, do not net a fish like that. <laughs> That's how not to net a fish. Okay. Here we go. It's gone. First fish of the day broke the ice, huh? Game on now. Game on. We're ready to roll. All we needed was some, a little bit of confidence, guys. A little bit uh -huh. of PFA. It's all Positive it takes. fishing attitude. That's all it takes. Yeah! Oh boy. Oh boy. I knew at some point it would happen for me. Big bug. Well, somehow in a blue moon, every once in a while, I'll snag a fish. <laughs> and that's what just happened. Wham. We're gonna let this little guy go. Money. Nice little brown. Best release of the day. <laughs> How's it feel to be the only guy that hasn't caught a fish? He's pretty terrible. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> He's a great cameraman. Looks, that box look all right. Yeah. He's just a little turbo. A little turbo. Oh, yeah. Hey, got the stank off, dude. <laughs> I like to water ski him. Skid him, <laughs> Skid him a rinky dinky dink. That a boy. Chase, you hook up? I just felt like it was time that I quit messing around, and you guys were like, ooh, you haven't caught a fish yet. I haven't been trying. I wanted you guys to feel good about he's, yourselves. He's a gentleman. I caught the most lively fish in the whole river. Baby. Yeah, bud. Whoop. Atta boy. It's real easy, guys. It only it's takes about easy. four hours. Let's do, it again. Let's do that again. I thought it was. Yeah. That's a big one. That's not coming off. Ethan fish, let me row. Yeah. Trade you. You got a fish? Maybe. Yeah. Ethan just caught a big guy. You think you can get him in? Uh, dude, I think I snagged on something while I had him hooked. I'm not, not feeling nothing. Ran into something. <laughs> or if you go, if you go on shore, Casey, go to shore. I can get on the thing and just run upstream. You know what I mean? Yeah. Do that. Way in the 
back in now. She didn't have to throw me in the fire that fast. <laughs> Literally started rowing for like two minutes and boom, catches a fish. I'm a new guy. I'm trying to row backwards to him, then he got stuck on something. I'm dropping anchor. I don't know what's going on. He hooked it and he's like, fish, fish, and then bzzz. I was just trying to stay straight. I had no bites. Zero bites. It's been a slow day, guys. It's just how it is out here on the river. We've tried a little bit of everything. We tried to double nymph in with rubber legs. Little bead heads, pheasant tails. Uh, threw the streamer for a while. Ethan's throwing a sculpin, nymph rig. A little, a little too windy. I don't know if the fish are just very temperamental. Like it was hot, really hot two days ago, and the temps dropped quite a bit. Uh, storms blowing in, so who knows? I just I can't imagine how many fish we've floated by today. This section is loaded with fish. Sorry, Ethan, with the better captain, that might have happened. No, dude, that's not your fault at all. You can't help it. Fish wrapped you around a log. Well, that concludes our video for today, guys. Sorry there wasn't more fish action. And my 30 inch brown eluded us today, but. I always say we gotta go through some slow days to have those fantastic days. And I think fantastic days on this river are soon to be had. The big salmon flies are gonna be hatching, like I said, within the next week, and then things will get real exciting. But thanks for watching, guys. Uh, like always, subscribe if you haven't, like the video, share it with your friends. I don't know, do something, but thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.